A random man high on crack once said, if You ain't first, you're last. Many have questioned their own placement. Oh, oh last. No! <laughs> so many kicks. You want to block a hit, maybe? These four men find their answers through a best of seven series. The idiot's wonderful Grand Prix. It will decide the best, the worst, and the first IWGP Intercontinental Champion. Day one, game one, Mortal Kombat one. October 5th, a round robin tournament played best two out of three. Each match win is two points. The game's win goes to the highest point score after all six matches have been played. Day two, game two, Nidhogg two. October 9th, played identically to Mortal Kombat 1's game with a high chance of going much longer. Caleb and Hunter have nearly broken the record for the longest single match in Nidhogg 2 history before. Day three, game three, Golf with your friends. October 11th. One game of golf is played with 15 points awarded to the winner. This will likely be the most frustrating game of the series for Aaron, who is 0-5 in golf with your friends. Day 3 continued. Game 4. Stick fight the game. One match is played. First to 10 wins. Each round one is one point. The experience edge for Aaron doesn't matter because he still f sucks. Old Picklestein returns and may or may not try harder this time. Caleb and Hunter are absolutely f***ed in this game. You can never expect what will happen with them. Day 4, Game 5, UFC 4. October 13th, again played identically to Mortal Kombat 1. Hunter walks in with little experience with this game, but anything can happen in UFC. Day 5, Games 6 and 7, Gang Beasts and Monopoly. October 14th, Gang Beasts has played first to 10 wins with each round being one point. The Monopoly game winner is awarded 20 points, although it might just end in a mass rage quit and the boys retiring from content. Their story begins a new chapter here. Over five days and seven games, only one can be the best! <laughs>